Well, folks, I said I would save the Lord of the Rings for a very special occasion, and I'm doing that today. We're going to have a box battle of value of one of, I think, maybe one of my favorite magic boxes ever created now versus Fallout. Fallout's been kind of crazy just because the amount of reprints, it's been so polarizing. It's gotten like a lot of, a lot of attention, both positive and minus, but this today, you know, we're going to throw the box values up on the screen. Um, I'm at 290 on this box. This is one I was holding for a while. Um, and then this one I'm at, I don't know, let's, let's call it, let's call it 290 as well. Cause I bought some at 350. I bought some at 250 and I bought some at 225. So we're going to even the scales. We're going to start at zero for both and see what kind of value that we get today. I'm uh, really excited. Like I said, I've been saving this Lord of the Rings for the right moment, and I'm hoping, I'm hoping that we have a serialized bowl inside. So without further ado, let's go ahead and uh, we're gonna do a nice, we're gonna do a nice thumb shot though, because the boxes look really good without the wizards covering on it. They just the colors kind of pop on that. So. Let's go ahead. There's no sense in saving some of this. I don't believe in holding sealed magic, period. Um, I just, I don't. Um, it's too risky in terms of reprints. Um, you know, Wizards has no shame lately. I, I do hold some draft and stuff. We're, you know, speculating on the singles values going up inside. But let's uh, take our two stacks. We're going to put essentially good hits here. We'll have some bulk on uh, maybe just the right side in general. And uh, we're going to try to do this very legit today. Very legit. So, again, without further ado, we're going to start with Lord of the Rings, just because I enjoy the Lord of the Rings very, very, very much. And uh, we're obviously looking for a serialized hit today in either set. That'll probably, you know, take the cake. Peregrine took some ring sight. We got a mountain. Okay, we got Chorus. We got the Protector, Mordor on the March, the Took, and Diabolic Intent coming in for, I don't know, I think what it is to be a $18 hit or so, we'll, we'll see. So, not a ton of value in the first pack there, other than Diabolic Intent. Um, with the Fallout, it's been wild, there's just value all over the place, Radstorm, value, boom, Nukes, big, value, Chaos Warp, value. Enlightenment, not not much. Clasp, Duchess, Rose, value. Three dog, value. Masterwork, that's the surge there. We got the Paladin and the Stranger coming in. So, right now, even though we pulled an intent, Fallout's going to be winning. <laughs> kind of crazy, I know. And uh, we have something big coming here in the in the last slot. I think I saw Great Oaths, Gimli, Crabane, Swamp, the guest. Oh yeah, she just keeps on eating. Display of power, the mists, press the enemy, surge, surge, Gimli, and Timber Protector. Man, before this print, uh, reprint, I remember this used to be a big pull. That was a $30 card before that card was reprinted. And then in foil, whoo! Trying to remember what set that was. Okay, we got a Moss Fire, Opportunist, the Boots, again, value in the Boots, Prairie Stream, Wasteland, the Groves, Ghoul, some value there. Blaspheme. Man, that just looks so good. Black Market. We got a stream. We got two big ones coming. I think we got, yep, Crucible coming, and we got the Signet Foil coming. Okay, so again, even though we pulled a Timber Protector and a Diabolic Intent, I don't think that matters. Um, Fallout is definitely in the lead here. Mark Wood. Haven Sphere. Okay, we got the Trebuchet, Birthday Escape, Basin, Little Worm Tongue. Oops, oops. There we go. Swamp, 
Balrog. We got of herbs. Okay. Hornberg hero. We got some glam drink. Legolas and a harbinger. Yeah, Fallout's definitely, definitely in the lead. Okay. Plus, if I'm going to hold sealed, uh, scribe, I'm going to hold sealed sorcery, not necessarily sealed magic. I just think that sorcery has a chance of doing something way more than uh, magic does at the moment. Evolution, five bucks. Okay, there's a craft. Silence. The Newmans. Oh, okay, okay. Caesar, and it looks like Dr. Madison. I feel like the price point of these boxes is very similar right now, so I feel like it's a interesting perspective in terms of like which one's performing better. Field Commander, Stalwarts, we got the Lookout. Okay, we got an Island. Guess. Fall. Horn of Gondor. Legolas, and... Okay, Hammerhine, nothing, nothing crazy there. So far this Lord of the Rings box hasn't heated up yet. Okay, Mountain. Man, that looks good. Piper. Barons. Camp. Oh, nice foil far seek. Chapel. The base. Summit. Vault 76. Open the vaults. Charge. Madison and the Radstag. Actually, I mean, nothing too crazy yet out of the uh, Fallout packs either. Woes, Deceive, Windlord, Cotton, okay, War Beast, Dunathan, Denethor. Man, that foiling looks good on Denethor. Call of the Ring, okay. One ring to rule them all. Beautiful Elven Chorus. Beautiful dismissal. It's a couple bucks, I think, on that, and a soul's attendant. Okay, we got definitely something in that back slot there, folks. Pan Harmonicon. Okay, the Ruthless Rad Rat. Vault. Gutsy. Overseer. Strong. Okay. Garvey. I don't know what Garvey's doing actually. Basilisk Caller. Okay. Rogue's Passage Surge. That's uh, about two bucks. Nuka Cola coming in 22 at the moment right now. And a Foil Wasteland coming in for around 18. Look at that sun on that thing. Beautiful. So far, Fallout is way in the lead. I don't even need to do box prices to tell ya. I can just tell ya, it's in the lead. We gotta pull something here fast with Lord of the Rings. Grishnok, Blade, Troll, Lost. Okay. Pippin, Mirkwood, Call the Ring, nice surge. Ariadoc, and I saw the foiling on it and I was like, can it be? Can it be a serialized? I do like the posters. Sorry, people. Nuclear Fallout, that's a couple bucks. Conviction. Okay. Woodland Cemetery. Can't believe how like how many Woodland Cemeteries, Drowned Catacombs, and things like that there are. It's just Colonel. Colonel looks good. Look, that's just mind blowing. I mean, that yeah, that was like a decent hit back in the day. Specimen, West Tech, so we got the Grave. Damn. Grave Titan. Oh. This 
It's going to be my last Lord of the Rings for quite some time, too, so enjoy, at least from my channel's perspective. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Did you see that? That means I think something big's coming, right, when you see that. Strider, forest, file, guava here. Okay, rangers, battle mace, beautiful surge, and attempt. Nothing was coming. Man, that second to last slot in Lord of the Rings, we haven't hit anything yet. Hinter? I mean, like, just think of all these lands in this new fan. Okay, Fire Shrieker. Bobble. Man, Bobble looks good. Look at that Bobble. Temple. Thrill Kill. Lethal. Man, that looks good, too. Wild Wasteland, Mystic Forge. Man. that sacrifice a desert almost perfect stranger and you never want to see that in that last spot holy cow is that bad these aren't like two of the best boxes by any means <laughs> for either of the uh, <laughs> the IPs Westfall Survivor, Golem, March, some, we need to hit, have something heat up here for us soon. Oh, there, and there we did. We did, in one ring, that's going to it's gonna bring a lot of value back to uh, to this box. It's a little off-center. I don't even know if, uh, if that'll sell because it's so off-center, but we got some value back there. Oh, 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 who's ever seen a pack with two rings? Have you ever seen a pack with two one rings? 95 there, and what's that one, 80? Have you ever seen that? And a glam drink. Jeez, oh man, that was a wild pack. So like, in this one pack, we're almost like over half the value of the whole box. So that did a lot of catching up for Lord of the Rings, and it might be in the lead at this point. It's gonna be a close. Junk, power armor, talisman. We haven't even pulled a bobble yet. Codsworth, okay, a couple bucks, plenty. Founder. Nice prairie, you know, another founder. Who pulls two rings in one pack? That's just, oh, there we go. It's for Surge Bobblehead, that's like 25 bucks. Jeez. Um, Lord of the Undead, and then Nuclear Fallout Foil. I can't tell, so like, these rad counters could go crazy where you know they're played in a lot of de or if this is the only like thing that rad counters are in is it going to be like i don't know the same like kaladesh where a lot of cards become unplayable because nobody's playing with rat you know rad counter based decks maybe i, I don't know yeah. for me i might like unload some of these things now to be honest because i i don't know i don't know that they're huge holds i do have that surge nuka cola i'm holding just because like I feel like that's a staple of this set. Riders, Doors, Barrow, Downs, Bajuka, Bog, Surge, Foil, Boom. Man, that's heating up for me. That box is heating up. Surge, Bajuka, that's like 30 right now? 40 even? Okay, Junk Jet. We got Indulgence, some Groves, Simi. Struggle. Mystic Forge. The red, look at those eyes on him. I don't know if you can even see how like crazy those eyes look. Single combat. There's Rose. Almost perfect. Some Tide. Tide looks good. Ghoulish Mare. He's like seven bucks. Wasteland, another 18 or so right there. And a Surge Infiltrator. Okay, that's our that's our Surge uh Wasteland's probably worth more, but we're gonna, <laughs> we'll put this up in the back anyhow. Um, nope. Okay, a couple packs left. They're both kind of heating up for the moment here. Surge bobblehead box, like, seems crazy. Oh, we got a poster, a foil poster in the back. I don't know if you guys saw, so this could be a big moment here. We don't know if we'll be able to pass or not. Rise. Rosie. Island, Sauron, he's the Necromancer. 
relic of the Necromancer, Sauron. All right, the Squall. The Shrif. Field Commander, and... Boom. Flame of the West. Not, uh... Not a... Serialized hit, but... Beautiful looking card, regardless. I mean, uh, come on. It looks great. I thought for just a minute, maybe we had one. Okay, Plains. Anthem. Rancher. Power Fist. Okay, okay. Preston. It's it's so hard because all these are value. It's like, I don't even know what to be excited over because they're all just like... Like, look at this. Look at that land art. Oh my god. Mutational advantage, yeah. Plenty. That's probably the weakest card in the whole pack. Liberty, yeah, you want to see that? Fallout again, like... And another Infiltrator. It's just like the other one we pulled. Like, I mean, I, what do you get excited for? Because there's a whole pack of value. Cast. Shadow Facts. Book. We have a Plains. Siege Master. You don't see him too often. White Tree. Isengard. Fall. Oh, Narso Reforged. Okay. Souls. I feel like we were missing a card in there. Is it just me or were we missing something? That felt really weird. Felt really weird. Felt really weird. I almost want to want to go back and count it. Six. Okay, so we had six after the land. Okay, right, we'll see. We'll see. Mothman. Secure. Some knuckles. Oh, another another surge bobblehead too. Surge bobbleheads in one box. Like what in the world? Talisman. Okay. Now, we'll go this way. Prairie. Duchess. Mutation. Keeper. Oh, Surge Guardian. Radstad and a Squadron. Okay. Man, two Surge Bobbleheads. What are the chances of that? Two One Rings in one pack. Like, what? What? Lembus, knights, horses, now, oath. Okay, all right, we're gonna see. All right, we got one, storm, okay. Two, warg, three, four, oh yeah, that's right. Caracas, beautiful. Nice attempt. Man, what a nice way to end, though. I don't have the Caracas. I have never pulled this in, uh, I have the original that I pulled from uh, Dominaria United, the Legends pull, but I have not pulled a tower. Looks like he's carrying like a briefcase. I don't know what that is. The white tower. And lastly, the Fallout. Can we pull the serialized card? Otherwise, I do believe that Fallout still won the day, but barely. I think that Lord of the Rings gave it a nice run for the money. Mr. Getsy, Rootbound, we got the Korea Talisman. Newman's, Charge, the Colonel, Malady, Pre War for War, Shadow Blood, oh yeah, Keeper of the Accord, okay. Oh, an Arcane Signet, and what do we got here? A Foil Soul Ring to end it. Holy cow, jeez, what an ending. What, what an ending. Oh my god. I'm, I'm, it's like such an ending, I'm just like crazy here. Man, that foil soul ring looks really good. I actually kind of like it more than the surge foil one. The, the ring itself just kind of pops back there. So, thanks for enjoying this with me. Thanks for checking out the channel. And, uh, you know, we got to see a comparison of value here, uh, for sure. A true comparison, because we had some good pulls in Fallout. We had some really good pulls in Lord of the Rings, especially that one pack. Saw a couple, you know, poster cards and such. So, 
It was a really good sample size. Uh, to be honest, I'm not sure which one pulled in the lead, but I do think just with the entire stack of Fallout, hang on, the entire stack of Fallout being worth something versus this stack of Lord of the Rings being worth something. This is why Fallout is going crazy, is because you don't have this in Fallout. So thanks again, folks. We'll talk to you all later.